Hey guys, welcome back to Koopa Keep. Um, I went ahead and I did a little bit of playing uh, off camera. Uh, in fact, spoiler alert, I kind of uh, kind of went ahead and beat the game over the weekend. But I did have some older saves. Uh, in fact, this one is the oldest one that I have. And I'm actually level 3 now. As you can see, I also picked up, pick up some different uh, flair. Yeah, Monocule. I think I wore that all the way through the game. I'm pretty sure I did. Uh, skull face paint. Awesome. I did have did have the black eyes. But I like the skull face paint. I don't know. What about that? Yeah, that ain't bad, but we're still going to go skull. Okay, my gear thus far. Level 2 Chris Dagger. And uh, adds a bleeding effect, uh, bleeding effect on a perfect attack. Um, okay, there is a check mark, alright. Um, oh yeah, I did get that. Let's go to my, okay, yeah, this is, this is pretty early. I don't have any, any badges yet. So I got that, I got that through going through, uh, I believe it's the Tower of Peace. It's by the, it's by the, I believe, Mongorian, uh, Mongorian Food. Oriental takeout place. Pick that up. Uh, sweaty headband. Uh, melee damage tax. Look five more damage. Um, now this bow was OP. I used this. Holy cow! I think I was almost level ten. And then uh, these are my absorption. Jet worked. And then after I hit level four, I went ahead and I uh, I went ahead and equipped that just because it did it uh, did give me automatic. Uh, Thorn damage to melee attackers. And... Yeah, see, I mean, it, the minus 5% damage, that can kind of stack up instead of gaining 10% 10, uh, 10 additional money because the way it's going to work, you're going to have more money than what you're going to know what to do with. How may I be of service? Here's what we're selling today. Yeah, I think uh, I'll keep the uh, keep the weapon on there. Oh yeah, I didn't even bother. I didn't even bother getting any of that. The KKK stuff. That's oh, I I did get the helmet. I take that back. I did get that. Perfect. Reducing the attacks. I think I got that maybe just for the armor. I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and pick these up while they're still kind of cheap. I didn't use any of these either. In fact, my guy at the end of the game, um, he was like so OP'd that I could do, um, let's see if I have my abilities. Okay, I have Mug. The next one is, yeah, Death of a Thousand Cuts. Holy crap. I could heal myself pretty much to full and recharge all of my power points in one attack. It was that. It was that stupid. But I'm just here rambling, so... Um, I believe the quest I wanted to do next was we have to solve Tweak's Steamy Dilemma. And let's go ahead and go to the map. Sorry if, the, if you hear these clicks, this uh, GameStop controller. The buttons are, buttons are rather, rather clicky. Okay, it looks like... Looks like all I gotta do is take Timmy. And oh, I don't have that. I don't have that unlocked yet. Oh crap! You wanna know what? I better since I got those weapon. Let me modify this guy. Yeah, you know, let's add another 10 damage to that. And... You know, I haven't tried anything with shock damage. So... We're gonna go with that. 
maybe here at the end of the game I'll actually uh, show you kind of my end game. Well, no, you know what? I shouldn't. I shouldn't spoil it. Oh, can I? Can I open it? Oh, money. Oh, yes. Take that. I have no idea why that worked twice, but hey. I think I might have, might have already talked to that guy. I don't know. You ever wonder what it'd be like to be a dolphin? Just doing flips, eating fish, and not you a care in the world? I continue to admire your awesomeness. Oh, I thought I would have gotten a uh, friend request. I must have already did that. I'm the kind of girl that... Oh, there we go. <laughs> it's almost like it's glitched. I'm the kind of girl I really like to do a lot of side stuff before tackling the main mission. Awesome. Unlocked that. And... <laughs> okay, I didn't get uh, didn't get my dragon shout yet. Now, if you're wondering, yes, this is a meth yeah, lab. Yeah, we got the package for Tweet Coffee. You got the in. <laughs> hey, that's not the usual kid that picks up the package, huh? Oh shit! It's a kip. It's a kip. Yo, dog. Uh, can't I just go right back home after the flight so I don't get grounded? All right. Looks like we got a fight. What do I have? Ain't got all day, pig. See, I don't think any of these guys are considered bosses. All right, cool. See, this has you been my money maker money. through most of the game was using a mug attack. Pretty much the way I would do it, I would just keep these guys in stun lock. Now his attacks, butters, his hammer, he can hit a whole row going up. I got one down already. Alright, take that. I want to show you guys what this bow can do. This bow is stupid. Down. And Butters. I think he should be able to smash him once. Police brutality. Okay, just for that, you're getting the bow again. Must be cooking up a secret potion. Wonder if it's a healing potion. I just love how oblivious Butters is to some stuff. I'm sorry, but okay, if I remember right. Oh, Astrid's fridge. Oh yeah, you will get uh, you'll you'll get some items like that or badges where you got stuff that'll heal you each turn. Yeah, I gotta aim for that because there's treasure up here. Oh yeah, and uh, you gotta put the man man bear sensor up there. Yes, get the treasure. See, that's not 10% damage on perfect targets. That's not too bad. Mm 
Okay, I don't think... Oh, I need to see if there's a hobo over along the way. Because you end up getting a quest from the mayor to search out all the whole... Yep, there he is. Now, I'm going to show you guys a little bit of a tip. Oh. Okay, for one, I aggroed him. For two, hit an enemy with your bow and then start the combat. The enemy will actually start off stunned for the first round. What if we just make friends instead? See what this dagger can do. He's got 28 shields. I don't know if I'll be able to hurt him, though. Okay, that did not work, but that's okay, because I'll have another attack. I might have to power attack him, I don't know, but in the meantime, I'm going to keep him stun locked. Now, what's cool about the burning uh, debuff is that they'll take damage every single turn. I'm not going to worry about stunning him again, but I will try a power attack, see what that does. Oh, wow. Okay, I found that hobo hideout. I don't think there's anything else over here, over here to search, so I'm just going to go ahead and uh, cut scene back. All right, and we're back. I went ahead and uh, traveled back here to uh, to the coffee shop so I can uh, free up Tweak because he's one of the three main guys that we need. You need her. Really? Oh, here we go. Where's today's delivery? Right here. Hmm. Yep. That's good shit. All right, Tweak. You can play for a little bit. But be home before dark or you'll be grounded. Grounded. Like the fresh grinds of our all-organic Tweak blend. Made with ingredients from local Tweakers. Thanks, kid. I gotta go get changed and then I'll meet you at the kingdom. All right. So, we got Tweak freed up. That's what I was waiting on. Healing abilities, recovery, being 25. Okay, that looks like just a little bit of a buffed up version of the wife beater. I don't see me using those, though. Alright, I'm going to take a quick look at the quest log. Oh yeah, Token's Fancy House. Okay. Actually, I think he's just a hop, skip, and jump over. I may be wrong. Did I friend you guys? Welcome to my coffee shop. Thanks for helping Tweak out in the back. Would you like to try some coffee? It's free. Now he's just up the road a little bit. I remember how this is going to go. This is a gated community. If you try again, I will pepper spray you back to the Stone Age. All right, so what we need to do now, we need to go find someone and buy... Something to help us against uh, gas or gross effects. 
And there's a guy over here. Actually sells some pretty decent stuff. I'll give you a good price. Oh, that's not him. Do I have that though? Oh crap. Okay, I made a wrong assumption. Oh, I'm stupid. I gotta go to Jimbo's. Alright, I'll cut scene over there. I'll see you guys in a minute. Alright, here we are at Jimbo's. What can I do for you, do kid? Needs to buy. Yeah, it's gonna be a little bit, but that thing right there, that's the best weapon in the game. Best one I've seen. We need to get the gas mask. And that's right, all of his patches and strap-ons are all defense. So, hey, I'll see you guys over there. Alright, guys, I'm back. I had, to, I had to take out some evil, evil elves. But I was able to get over here safely. Now I'm going to wear the funny gas mask. I you, sir. I have five years training at... What the fuck? Oh, no! It's a good day to die. Uh, for you, that is. Alright, we're gonna go with... Oh, I better make sure sure, that... A three -hour combat workshop in the deadly <laughs> okay, now, notice in the status effects, if you have any sort of uh, buffs hey, or debuffs, it will, it will uh, go ahead and list them here. And I want to make sure that the guy I'm hitting doesn't have the boss abilities. So you're making me late for my Elks Club meeting? Because what that means is that they're immune to bleeding, gross, and stuns. This is private property, sir. Ooh. Now, if I just keep them on the ground. This shouldn't take long. I might be able to drop him. This thing can do about 120, 130 damage in one burst. Okay, he's hurting. All right, butters, finish him off. Die! Apparently I can't search him. I know he comes back. Okay, I better get that stupid gas mask off. Do that, and let's check that. Billy Club. Well, it lowers uh, target's defenses on perfect attacks, but... There we go, treasure. It's not bad. I don't do a whole lot of healing unless I have to. Oh, and we have... Let's see if it does it twice. Aww. Sometimes it's good. Oh, I think there's something back here. Yep. Yeah. Can I help you? <laughs> What's this? Oh, the elf took the stick again? Hang on a second. Thank you for that message, traveler. I shall make haste to Koopa Keep. Mom, can you drive me to Eric's house? Awesome. We got token now. Oh, derp, I missed that. Taco. Yeah, it's funny, this guy won't talk to you anymore. Move along, sir. I can't look at you without feelings of deep personal shame. Let me check the old quest log here. 
Alright, turns out we need to go back to Coop Keep. Well, soldiers reporting for duty, Grand Wizard. Nice work, douchebag. Now all my men are here and ready to fight for the... Wait a minute. Where's Feldspar? Where's my level 12 deed? Uh, hey, yeah, where's Quay? He's in detention. What? He flipped off the principal, so he's in detention again. Oh, my God. If they've locked away our thief in detention, we have no hope of getting back the stick of truth. We have to break him out. Ah, no way, man. Last time we broke Craig out of detention, we all got in trouble. Getting into trouble is a risk that douchebag is willing to take. Oh, uh, really? break out our thief, douchebag. But don't worry, I will not let you go unprepared. I'm going to teach you how to use magic. Meet me at the training barracks. It's time for you to learn Dragon Shot. Oh, this is good. I think I got friend requests from everybody. Can he? That kind of never gets old. Oh, that's right. Yeah, I got a flower for him. Yay. All right. Fight well, douchebag. But to truly succeed in combat, you must learn to harness the power of your fart. Farting on an opponent at precisely the right time is key to battle. I shall show you how it's done, but first, you must take the gentleman's oath. You must promise to never, ever fart on anyone's vows, okay? Farting on an opponent is necessary, but farting on someone's vows is not true. Do you understand? All right, then let's begin your training. To conjure Dragon Shout, you must first clear your mind and take in a deep breath through your butthole. Like so. Then, let it rumble inside you, and... Suck it, Chuck! I'll show you one more time. Suck it in. Let it rumble. Drag it out! Now you. Ready? Okay, if you guys ever try this, this is tricky. You have to hold that, find the frequency, and then wait. Then, press up on the right stick. Because, see, I was hitting the uh, control stick when I thought I had the frequency. Just just wait for it. The prophecies are true. Could it be that the dragonborn has come at last in our hour of need? Now let us try your skill on a real opponent. Hey, hey, Princess Kenny. <laughs> Did you come here, Isaac? Shh, don't tell him. Just real quick, Princess Kenny. Sir Douchebag wants to show you something. All right, you two. Far! Sir Douchebag, show Princess Kenny the magical powers I have taught you. Suck it in. Find the frequency. And hold it. Then release. <laughs> that was fucking hilarious! <laughs> Dude, that was fucking awesome! <laughs> oh, okay, good job, sir, douchebag. That was sweet. Thanks, Princess Kenny. That's all for now. <laughs> Thank you, old pal. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, but, dude, seriously, remember, don't ever do that on someone's balls, okay? Seriously. You have mastered Dragon Shout. From now on, it will be easier for you. Kenny will assist you on your quest, douchebag. Now go get Craig while I rest and relax upon my throne. All right, so we got Kenny as a buddy. He's got some interesting attacks. I've never had to use him, though. That's right. I already looked at all this stuff. But something I am going to do is, for one, not be a derp. For two, I'm going to sell all my junk. Just keep hitting Y. There we go. 123 bucks. <sighs> so, our next quest is at the school. We gotta break Craig out. Oh, it's not up there. It's down there. Which, that little quest in itself that's going to take a little bit and i don't think i'm gonna have enough time on this video but that's going to kind of be the basis for the next one so i uh, thank you guys for watching the video uh should be seeing another one up here soon then within the next few days so as always till next time